We love to see it. The Cubs, they beat the Rockies 5-0. to zero. I, I, I heard this guy too much, but, bro, he balled out. Shout out to Imanaga. He had a monster day pitching the ball today um, with the Cubs, bro. I mean, he pitched six innings and damn near pitched a no-hitter no all the way up until the sixth inning. But he had two hits only, zero runs, zero walks, and nine strikeouts. And I think, bro, I think it's safe to say the Cubs might have him one. <laughs> They might, they might, they might have got that guy in uh, Imanagwe, bro, or Imanagu. And like, they might have got that guy, bro. And I think the Cubs, it, it started off kind of rough in the beginning of the season because a lot of people had a mutual understanding of the Cubs are not necessarily a, a, a guaranteed playoff team this season, but they can possibly make it there if, if anything happens. You know, we may be okay to get there. We have a good season. We go on a good roll, but I mean, hey. We might have that guy that can really give it a, get us over the hump. So, you know, I I, I think it, it really gives us a, a new excitement to the game and it gives us a lot of hope. So, with that being said, bro, I, I think the Cubs, hey, I'm excited for the season now. <laughs> I'm excited for the season now. The first, week, the first opening week was kind of rough against the Rangers playing the defending champs. But I'm kind of excited for the season now to see what Imanaga does, bro, because... Hey, Imanaga, he he's he's a baller. And I hope I'm saying his name right. Imanaga, Imanaga. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm saying it right. Either, either way it go, you know who I'm talking about because he's he dominated at the Cubs opening day. So nine strikeouts, pitched six innings. Damn near had a no hitter all the way up into the sixth inning. So, hey, you, you love that. You love to see it if you're a Cubs fan. 